Hey everyone, it's Kyle at Great Bags. We get a lot of emails from our customers regarding the Stair Pro and why we don't carry or sell the Rainbow Mates anymore. So in today's video, we're gonna cover and go over the Stair Pro and how to assemble it to your hose. Let's go over why we don't carry the Rainbow Raymates anymore. And one word for you, availability. They're very hard to get and when we do get them, they're super trash and it's not worth our time to go through them, clean them up and fix them. So our solution to that is the StairPro Mini Electrified Power Nozzle. Whether you have an E-Series, SE, or PN2 hose, the StairPro is gonna fit as long as you have the mini extension piece and this extension cord. Like I mentioned earlier, this uh, assembling process will work for either the E-Series, SC, or PN2 main hose. You wanna make sure you have the metal extension piece and the adapter cord. What you're gonna wanna do is locate the button lock, locate on extension one, and insert that piece into the stair pro. You'll hear it lock. Next, you're gonna wanna take the adapter cord, find the female connection, and plug that into the stair pro. You may notice that the cord will not go on all the way. That is not gonna be a problem. I promise you it'll still connect and you will have power going to the mini head. Once you got the adapter cord plugged into the stair pro, go and get your main hose. Put the hose into the middle extension wand. Push it all the way in until it's got a secure connection. Take the male plug and plug that into the hose. You might push the cord in pretty hard to get a secure connection. If you notice your cord falls out easily, take a pair of needle nose pliers and gently, slightly bend these prongs outward and that'll make a secure connection when you get it plugged into the hose. Once you got everything plugged in, you're ready to turn your vacuum on and whether your hose has a trigger or not, pull that trigger and your power head, mini power head will have power. Now for all you E2 two-speed owners out there, once you get your Stair Pro, you're just gonna have the Stair Pro itself. You're not gonna have any adapter cord or metal extension piece. And to get your Stair Pro hooked up to your hose and get in working condition, it's very simple. Take your E2 two-speed uh, hose, plug it into the Stair Pro. You'll hear it click in the button lock, but if you look at the two prongs from the Stair Pro, there's like a big gap before it even makes a connection to the hose. So what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna wanna push your hose in even more. You might have to push the button lock in to get it to keep going, but just keep pushing the hose in. I don't know if you can see that, but there'll be a very small gap between the Stair Pro and the hose through the prongs. But once you push it on all the way through the button lock, it's gonna stay on there pretty well. You're gonna have to actually put some force into it to get it to move. So once you get it on there all the way, you should be good to go. Turn your vacuum on. And then simply pull the trigger. All right, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope all you rainbow owners out there were able to get your Stair Pro in working order. Just a quick reminder, if you have the SE, E-Series, or PN2 main hose, you're gonna need the metal extension piece and the adapter cord. But all you Rainbow E2 two-speed owners out there, all you're gonna need is the Stair Pro itself. If you have any other questions or need any extra assistance, send us an email at servicegreatvax.com and we'll get you taken care of. And as always, thanks for watching.